Hey guys, this is Maisha. I'm back. All right. I'm here to just give you guys inspiration, motivation, and just so that you know that anything that you want to accomplish in your life, you have the ability to do it. Nobody else can do it for you, only you. This is some tips that I have. I took a long mental break, did nothing. <laughs> and this is the beauty, right? You can take breaks, but don't take long breaks. Don't do it <laughs> for the most part. Don't check out on life. The reason why is life is gonna go on, but the beauty is you will always hit the reset button. See, a lot of people feel like once you in this certain area of life that you're dissatisfied with, you can't make any changes. And I'm here to tell you that change happens within a moment's decision. Tony Robbins said that. You can make change within a moment's decision, but the key word in that is decision. It's the decisions that we make on a consistent basis that's going to make us get close that's who we want to be in life or bring us further. But the beauty is we have the ability to hit that button where we can say, I'm going to start today. Come hella high water, I'm going to start today. See, a lot of people worry about what other people think about them. They try to please people and live a life that's not fulfilling to them. What the thing I'm here to tell you is, is you have to make you happy because we have one life to live that we know of, right? We have one life to live, the one that we're living right now. And you have to live a life that makes you happy. Dissatisfaction is changeable. If you're not happy where you at, it may not be easy to do, make an initial change. You probably have to go through, through some things to develop mental toughness. But once you develop that mental toughness and strength, you will get to an area in your life where you become unbotherable. Nothing bothers you and you can live that fulfilled life. So what I would say to do is to get a pen and paper and write down some goals that you have. Write it down, you understand? Just because you probably went through a whole year where you felt like you was unsuccessful and didn't accomplish your goals, most people do not write down their goals. Most people create their goals in their mind. So the step that you have to take is writing it down. There is power to pen and paper. Once you write it down, you get to see what you have in your mind on that paper. Once you see it on paper, you could bring it into reality. That word impossible does not exist in my mind. Don't set those limitations where something's impossible. And don't listen to other people when they tell you that you can't do it. Because remember, when people tell you something, they're looking at things from their perspective. We have different visions for a reason. Something that's meant for me may not be meant for my husband. Something that's meant for me may not be meant for my daughter or my son. You understand? I am a unique individual. I have unique giftings and talents, and you have your own unique giftings and talents. So remember that what another person don't see, that's okay. That's okay. It's for you. So you want to write down that goal on pen and paper and you want to break it down. Probably break it down into quarters or break it down into actionable baby steps on what you could take to bring your goals into fruition. And just remember, if you don't get it the first couple of times, seek out mentorship. We are in the dawn and age of the internet, right? So there's always information that's accessible to us. Get a mentor. You don't have to pay for a mentor, you know? If you can, it'll probably shortcut your path to a lot of things. But remember, you have YouTube, you have a lot of information online that you could just read and gain mentorship from the people that's actually doing what you're doing. And this is the thing, if you have a goal and somebody else done it, remember, it's very possible. It's just that the way that you're going to make it happen for you is work consistent action uh people like to put this tag that they're not consistent people everybody's consistent in something it's just what are you consistent with doing nothing are you consistent at giving up once it gets hard we're gonna eliminate that word we never give up right so become and become dedicated to where you want to be because I'm here to tell you that time is going to keep on going by. 
whether you see it or not, look at this year. This year went by very fast. Years is going to keep on going. But the beauty is that you have the ability to hit that button to start when you want. But make sure when you do hit that button, find something that you're passionate about and work on it and give it that time. Break up those goals, like I said, do it in quarters and keep on working on something every day. Read, listen to audios, podcasts to give you mental toughness. You want to get mental toughness and just keep on having that mindset that you can accomplish anything in the world. You want to set affirmations for yourself, something that you're going to tell yourself every single day to remind you that you are strong, worthy, and very capable and measure where you started. Every day, tell yourself that you're getting better and better at your craft and you're going to see that within a year, you're going to have great, great growth in your life. Celebrate every single win. See, a lot of people master being tough on themselves, but you have to celebrate every single win that you have. And once you do that, you're going to see that you're going to have a very, very happy, fulfilling life, and you're going to be getting closer and closer and closer to your goals. So guys, Thank you so much for watching this video. I'm so grateful to um, have, you know, people watch my videos. And all I gotta say is just work on your goals. The biggest project that you're going to ever work on is yourself. You know, we are individual, um, unique, unique beings. So just look at yourself as an amazing project that you're gonna work on on a consistent basis and have fun. Celebrate success, celebrate wins, and you'll see that change will happen very, very fast. I'm wishing everybody a successful year.